Here's trying to figure out what started a South Charlotte apartment fire. Take a look at some of this new video sent to us. You can see the chimney completely collapsing shortly after the fire started. 50 firefighters responding to those flames, two of them actually getting hurt. Wake up Charlotte's Richard Devane now live for us this morning just off of Quail Hollow Road where this fire broke out. Richard, what's the latest? Yeah, Ben, good morning to you. Good Monday morning, everyone. The latest is that those firefighters uh, had minor injuries. They were treated here at the scene. They're going to be OK. But as you take a look at this house, the investigation continues into what started this blaze. You can tell by just the damage here that everyone who lives in this particular section now seeking a new place to live. Up in flames Sunday afternoon, this South Park apartment building on fire. It happened around two Sunday at the South Park Commons on Headley. When fire crews arrived, they say they saw smoke billowing above the building, which was engulfed in flames. We just saw a big black smoke in the sky and we just heard fire trucks. So we heard all the commotion and just looking at it, I'm just like, wow. More than 50 firefighters called to the scene. Fortunately, no one, including residents, were hurt, although two firefighters treated on the scene for minor injuries. Never saw anything like this before. It was pretty pretty scary. Yeah. You could feel the heat standing over on the um, side over here. The roof destroyed, charred wood everywhere. Not much of this apartment building is left as investigators work to figure out what happened. Knowing that in the back of my mind, anything, anything can happen, no matter where you are. So I'm just happy that nobody was hurt. Um, and, you know, thank God. Indeed, at this hour, if you look at this, the res debris of this house, you, this apartment complex, you can tell a lot of folks lost everything they had. Of course, we'll be here throughout the day giving you more information on what may have caused this fire and, of course, damage estimates and, of course, what those folks are now doing. We'll have more later, but for now, right here on South Charlotte, Richard Devane for Wake Up Charlotte.